Each of the wooden model ships you see displayed on the screen were built by hand. The cost was less than $25 each. Stand by for the beginning of a series on how you can build a ship just like this. This series is designed for the beginning shipbuilder, not for someone highly experienced. It will teach you some of the early skills that you'll need, and it's good practice before spending hundreds of dollars for a very expensive ship that hopefully someday you'll choose to do. And that's what I hope to do next. Hi and welcome to my YouTube channel. And I've been doing some different things. Matter of fact, I have a new slogan for myself. Uh, Boiler Dan, I know a little bit about everything and a whole lot about nothing. So here's a little bit of something that I've discovered. And I actually have made a series of these wooden model ships spending less than $25 for the entire thing. And I thought that would be something that people might be interested in. If you're an actual shipbuilder and you go into great details, this video is not for you. This is somebody who, like myself, just wants to find something uh, creative so you can take your creative energies and run with it. So I'll show you some that I've made. What I've done is I'm making one for each of my grandchildren and I have seven grandkids. I've named each one something to do with their personality or something that they like. This particular one is, is called Gridiron and I have a grandson who dreams to be an NFL football player. So all these are NFL football flags and there's some other unique things on it. But more importantly, let me show you where I purchased it from and what I do to make it unique on its own because the original ship does not have this type of a uh, mast system to it. So I just kind of came up with that on my own. So let me start the overview and then I'll do a follow-up video and show the actual build of one of these ships because I've got one underway. So let me uh, show you what comes. This ship was made from a packet just like this. Now there are a couple of different versions. This particular one I paid less than $13 for. They are all laser cut, so I'll get this out in a minute and show it to you. The difference between one that costs $20 and one that costs $12, from what I can tell, is the instructions. The $12 one is a copy of a copy, and some of the numbers are very hard to read. The one that I paid $20 for is an original, but this is all the instructions that you get. It's just visual and numbers. There's also a few errors. I will point those out for you in the video. And if you decide to build one just for the fun of it, at least you won't have to try and figure out what you were supposed to do. There's also a few extra parts that I've never figured out where they're going. So anyway, let me show you, uh, do the unpacking, and show you in detail what's inside this pack. Okay, when you pull all these out, obviously some of the masts comes with a little stand and then I don't use this particular thread that comes with it there's not enough for what I do particularly but you can see here's all the small parts the cannons are there here's your planking here's your deck and then you can see it's marked where all the different parts and pieces go more planking and then this is the uh, body of the ship the, the helm and the stern I guess I'm, I'm not real versed in all of this yet and these all punch out and fit into these corresponding spots by number here's a close-up of all the laser cut wood parts and they are marked sheet one two three four five six and they are clearly marked with the numbers. I'll go through them if there is a, an error on the sheet. But this is what they look like out of the package. So the next thing is, let's start putting this together. Again, I pre-stain and pre-paint most of the parts. So this concludes part one of unpacking what you get. And now we'll begin the pre-assembly and tools that you'll need. That'll be 
part two of this series.